啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome to a new DLC. We do. We have a new one, and it's called Off the Grid. I'm getting to play it a little bit early, but it is uh, available right now for uh, pre-order on Steam. And I think they've also got a discount on the base game and the other DLC, so you can complete your collection. So if you are interested in this DLC, now is time. Uh, to get it. Um, but what we're going to do is uh, jump straight in uh, to the game and find out all about uh, the campaign for Mayor Tabitha Winsock by providing health care for the supporters of her green initiative. Exciting times. Here we go. It sounds like those holistics people have set up camp in the Wanderoff County Park. I've heard that they're attempting to monitor how people feel with something called a wellness index. I know nothing could bum me out faster than the term wellness index. <laughs> Get away from my feelings, you animals. Thank you, Harrison. Wander off. Good. Good name. Where's the letter? We're going to get... Yep, there it is. We're going to get a letter. Love it. It's that time again. Our county is approaching another mayoral election, and I've decided that beginning our journey towards a greener tomorrow is long overdue. Our voter research suggests that it is, it's the issue on everyone's mind, and I am willing to fall on the sword of extensive positive press by founding the Department of Green Things. <laughs> when people remember Tabitha Winsock, I want them to remember my green initiative and how I got re-elected that time. Please support the initiative by taking care of our green-minded, recently pro-Winsock community. I need them in this time of need, uncertainty and poor voter polling because, frankly, the dead can't vote. <laughs> vote Tabitha Winsock. That's our beautiful mayor. Um, <laughs> so here we are in a two point county. You can see here that we uh, recently did uh, the remix update. That was a free update. And we've uh, done the remix in World One. These first three hospitals are our World One. And these three hospitals, if you've just bought the base game and this DLC, uh, you will need to have uh, got one star in each of the hospitals in World 1 because they're sort of tutorial hospitals and they, you sort of learn the game a bit while you're going through them. These need to be completed before you'll be able to play the DLC. And I think often they also recommend that really it's best if you can get to somewhere like Ducksworth uh, through the base game uh, before progressing onto the DLC, somewhere around there, because uh, you unlock an awful lot of machinery and rooms that tend to get used in the DLC as well, um, but it's not necessary. So uh, let's find the new area, which is over here. Harrison came over, look, here he is. Look how green it is. Look at this, here are three new hospitals with this DLC, <gasps> excited. So it's just below uh, the Pointy Mountains. This is the Bigfoot DLC over here. So it's just below there, look. Oh yeah, look at the farmland. Oh, that's like that Harry Potter house. Look at this farmland. And look, Windsock City. Oh, isn't it beautiful? The solar panels and wind turbines. And then over here, Wonder Off. So this is where we're going to be uh, starting. Love the name. Look at the little tents. Oh my goodness, they're amazing. Um, so let's let's have a look here. What have we got? Wonder Off. Keep campers feeling good deep inside this county park. <gasps> campers, it's a camping site amazing here we are look <gasps> everything looks so different what's the weather um so wonder off county park welcome to the wonder off county park where holistics oh no uh holistics oh the the ceo of that place comes around your hospital sometimes um and he uh keeps being sick everywhere and stuff like that um because from what i understand their natural remedies gives him a bit of a dicky tummy. <laughs> anyway, where holistics have been farming rare natural ingredients for years, uh, once they heard that the mayor was planning to trial her green initiative in the area, they decided to open a nature commune and take advantage of the foot traffic. It's our job to care for the people attached to those feet. Our funding from holistics will depend on how well we're scoring on their new scale. Uh, yes, the less than fine people of holistics <laughs> have developed something called a wellness index. Ooh, this this is cool. Um, 
a wellness uh, index which uses a number of different criteria to measure the overall well-being of a community. They believe that they found a correlation between high scores on the wellness index and a willingness to purchase their organic tat. <laughs> Uh, we won't receive much for diagnosing and treating patients, so if we want to make money, we'll need to score well on the wellness index by focusing on its six criteria, staff and patient happiness, attractiveness, hygiene, reputation and cure rate. All these things here, look at all this. <gasps> so if we score well, they give us cash, I see. They give us the cold hard doubloons. Attention, Ooh. urinating anywhere in the hospital will not be tolerated. But, I mean, we're outside. Look at this, right? Let's just, um, what we need to do is just pause a minute, right? Because uh, I always like to get a really lovely look at uh, the new uh, areas before we start playing. And this is amazing. Look at this. We've never seen anything, uh, every area when we get DLC just looks different, just so different. Um... It's, it's great. I love it. I'm loving the trees. I um, mean, it does really look sort of quite hippie around here, doesn't it? This is amazing. Look at look at these tents and a little campfire. Oh, I need pots. Um, but we do have a lot of litter around. Uh, we saw whom I used to call Spalding, but now he's Albert Crank popping up to say there's quite a lot. Look, somebody's urinated here. Quite a lot of rubbish about the place. So a lot of litterers. Uh, in the campsite. Outrageous. Um, <laughs> these are lovely. Just look, look. Oh, like a little sawmill thing. Ah, oh, these greenhouses are lovely. Look at these. They're amazing. Oh, we've got a little place. Oh, look. I, I like the detail of the, the spade, the shovel in the ground where they dig up their goods. Lovely. Oh, <gasps> <laughs> more logs and i like the flags as well good good love oh composting nice little pond here this is great i love it i love it um another little camp over here um and i think the the patients um do tend to come from these uh, large tents i think they come from certain ones. I don't think it's these ones. I think it is these ones. I think. Uh, we'll have to find out. I can't remember. I did play it a little bit uh, a while back. So, uh, what have we got here? Index. Ooh. Uh, what? Set up camp. So, we need hospital attractiveness of 50%, which, to be honest, clearing up. So if we, I mean, clearing up is going to do this, I think. So high energy, hygienic, weak bladder. Not The weak bladder is a bit of an issue, to be honest, with janitors. But there we are. There we are. Uh, so we're going to turn those off and get them on uh, cleaning. Get them on cleaning. In fact, we might, should we see funny and hygienic? You know what? We'll also employ uh, them. Now, they are going to become uh, our upgrade a person um, they will do um, purely eventually but for now we can get those couple of janitors cleaning up cure three patients fast uh, fine staff morale at 60% we can do this uh, our wellness funding the monthly funding that you receive from holistics can vary between 50 and 120% of your current running costs uh, depending on your score on the wellness index during the previous three months evaluation period. Okay. Alrighty. So let's, um, uh, being that we don't get a lot of money from just building random stuff, um, we need to remember that. Take it into consideration. I don't want to be in that room. Let's toggle this grid. Um, and these, uh, the console version, of course, was released uh, recently. Um, and, that, and that does have these uh, features too. Um, look, we've got a new reception desk. The reception desk looks different. I love it when the reception desk looks different. And this is another one of these hospitals, a bit like an overgrowth where it's built outside. And these stones are denoting the edge of, um, of where we can actually build here. Like our walls, if you like. 
uh, which is great. So, a um, bit tricky actually to know where to start. It's also open. I, I don't know where to begin. <laughs> I don't know where to begin. Um, okay, well, uh, here is as good a place as any, I suppose. Um, let's hire a uh, an assistant. Uh, this one, hangry. The hangry, it's fine. Uh, and what we're going to do, actually, we'll leave that. We are just going to change to lemon. That's it. Apply to all assistants, thanks. There we go. Excellent. Now, we can't avoid building a GP office. Uh, might as well unpause it. We can't avoid uh, building a GP's office. We have to do it. So we're gonna have to spend this money. So let's let's do that. Let's get the the GP office in. Um it's looking pretty good actually. Oh I like the sounds. The sounds of nature. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Uh, we do have to put in this. I'd like to put a window here. Um, uh, oh yeah, new items are going to be a thing. Oh, we're gonna, there's going to be so many new items. It's going to be exciting. Let's pop in. This is from the Bigfoot DLC. In this coffee, uh, this chocolate hot hot chocolate. That's it. Yeah, it's. Um, what's nice about it is it increases happiness. That's that's what I like about it. Um, and I get asked this quite a lot. Why do we bother putting these things? in a GP's office. If your GP doesn't have time to deal with their knees, then your GP is overworked. Um, and they, because they will use them. They do absolutely use these things if they have time. Um, so, uh, because it's important for staff to remain uh, happy while at work, particularly now, because staff happiness is, is a, the whole blinking thing now. Um, oh, we need to check the temperature. What's the temperature of this area? It's hot. Right, we're, we're in a hot place. So I actually have the aircon unit. I forget. Was this from Close Encounters? It could have been. But I don't... Actually, let's, let's build this. So we can see here that it doesn't require maintenance, but it um, also doesn't let off uh, a lot. It's a bit like the, the, the pineapple thing. Um, let's we go to temperature. Um, plus, a bit cheesy. Um, so I think we are going to have to go for a big one um i think i think i think we are so we'll do that now we need to hire a gp we don't have one but we're going to go with lulu um i look at the walls on the outside of the gp that's all sort of bamboo as well that's amazing let's uh let's do that so we have our gp doing their thing uh their head is coming through their bandana that's that's a bit of a shame that's a bit of a shame. Oh, it, oh, it's fixed itself. That's that's amazing. Oh no, no, oh, it came through again. <laughs> okay. Um. So where are we at? Eighty-two percent. Well, I think what we'll do, we'll ask them to go for treatment. Now, what, what is it that they have? Ooh, let's see here. Injection room. Weeping iris. Oh, sustained. It's new illness time. I, all the new illnesses. I'm excited. Uh, sustained sobbing has left the sufferer with a leaky aperture or two. They require cheering up and a chemical treatment that tightens the body's plumbing. <laughs> like it. Let's get them to wait. What's great about um, building this room and why I'm keen to build this particular treatment room is because an injection room will cure a variety of different illnesses so in a young hospital this room will give you bang for your buck unlike a clinic which only deals with uh, one illness uh, and nothing else which can be a bit problematic in a young hospital um, not good bang for your buck uh, so I'll pop that in here um, and we are going to need uh, one of these uh we should probably put in a fire extinguisher the place could catch fire actually what we'll do we'll pop this over here so everything to do with handymen is pretty much over here um now i'd like to give them something to eat and drink this helps with staff happiness um so they can deal with those uh, needs uh, also hygiene very important and it's good for them to sit down um and relax as well that helps keep their happiness higher for longer there we are uh, we're going to need a nurse for that oh look at this 
Laura uh, Lauren Bottom uh, will work for peanuts. Brilliant. Has potential and is positive. Oh my goodness. It doesn't get better than that. So we are going to set that to the injection room. And I like to use purple for treatment. There we go. Excellent. Loving it. Uh, right then. So another room I feel we should be building is a facility room and toilets. I think this is probably a fairly good move. Look at this. The rain water. Oh, amazing. I'm looking forward to it. Diagnosis decision. Uh, send for treatment. 82%. What we'll do, actually, let's just quickly come into the policy screen. Overview. Policy. Um, let's bring this down to 80. I think we need a cure rate of 70%, don't we? Fast track decisions. They can leave rooms. No training staff messages and promote staff automatically. Um, staff morale is 60. Need to cure three patients. So we're on it. We're on it. Uh, we are on it. So let's see here. Uh, I do think toilets are fairly important. So let's. Uh, I don't really want to uh, accidentally. All right, stop it. I want to move this. Uh, just stick it there for the minute. Right. Let's pop this here. Okay. And let's stick the door in. And uh, I've got a few options here. I think I'm going to go with this water closet. This comes, I think, from the retro pack. And I just I really like it. Um, okay. Uh, but we'll, we have to go with normal sinks. I'd love some sinks and hand dryers to go with the water closets. That would be amazing. Okay. Oh, there we go. Right. Oh, that's a new binny. Look, recycling bin. Reuse it. Don't lose it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Get that out there. Um, so, now, we need our personal best clock. It's a very important item for the toilets. Um, and also our creme de la creme uh, dog painting. This one. Um, oh, there he did. Both we really there we go. Uh, and the gold certificate, which I, I always like to just sling in there. Now, uh, also it's hot. I keep forgetting that. Uh, not temp. What am I doing? Uh, filter, temperature, one of these. Actually, we'll do a small one at each end. Because it's not, oops, not masses of room here. There we go. So we've got a toilet down, uh, which I think is pretty, pretty important. What have we got here? 65%. Ew. Okay. Get them to wait. 65, get them to wait. So they must have a different illness here. So let's get, uh, I think I might go cardiology. It's a pretty good room, actually. Uh, oh, look at these. I love these. Oh, we've only got the carrot ones at the moment, it looks. Um, but... Uh, We'll, we'll get into that in a minute because I'm about to do food. It's just that we have to build more diagnosis. So we're going to go with this one. Cardiology. It's not going there, is it? Uh, cardiology? Yeah, that'll do. It's difficult, really, with layout in this hospital. Don't really, don't really know at the moment. Just plopping things down. Get that in there. Um, we are going to need a bunch of things. So this helps boost diagnosis. So I'll pop those in there. They also boost treatment, which is why I put them in the injection room. That helps boost diagnosis. Um, we would like hand sanitizer. Let's go for the staff. Uh, we should have a fire extinguisher in here, uh, along with a temperature thingy. Listen to the music. Amazing. And a sweet dispenser. Lovely. Um, and what I might do is put, put plants uh, in this hospital. So we don't normally put plants in hospitals because to be honest, they just cause an awful lot of work for janitors. But you know what? I'm going to take on the challenge. I'm going to take that challenge on. 
Uh, and they'll be pretty too. And we'll just have to get a tribe of janitors into water plants. That's what we're going to do. Oh, I want the challenge. So, um, so we're going to do it. Now, what else could we put in here? Oh, yeah. So I do, do you wish to have a chair? Okay. Um, now, I don't think I've got enough room for this now because I put a plant in and whatnot. Um, but you know what? I think I will. The staff enjoy actually having some punching with that. Uh, they enjoy that. Um, makes them happy. Put those in as well. There we go. Nice. Excellent. Um, so we're also going to need uh, diagnostic staff. Not the best. But, well, I mean, they're good. It's just that I'd rather fill that up with diagnosis and not have stamina uh, thrown in the middle randomly. Uh, but there we are. And I like to put green on my diagnostic nurses. I don't know why. So, okay. I've got that going. Now, let's have a look at items. Do we have any new bennies? Not that I can see. Um, do you know what we could do? Filter this probably off the grid. <gasps> there is. Look at these new items. So for seating, this is our new seating option. It's a log bench. All bark, no mites. 300 doubloons. Unlock for 75 kudosh. Increases comfort. Right. We'll have them. There we go. So here's our new seating. Our new bennies. Let's get those down. There we go. Excellent. Uh, what was that? Funding update. Holistics will now cover 86% of our total running costs the next three months. We have, we're not done. We've not, we've not done well. We have not done well. What is this? Dimension door? Oh my goodness. Uh, let's concentrate on the food. So as we know, we have carrots and stuff going on here. So these carrots uh, is the food option. Uh, what is going on, doctor? Doesn't take long to grow, reduces hunger and is self-sustaining. Amazing. So I'm assuming that these won't need restocking. Let's, let's find out. So we'll put, pop those here because uh, I think these have been changed a little bit since I lost all them. Um, so we'll see how they work. Um, and do you know what? We'll put a couple over here. Let's move these over. Let's save people wandering off for miles to use them. Have we got any more kick around? I don't think so. Okay, great. Uh, uh oh, that didn't sound good at all. Oh, an emergency. Pharmacy emergency. Uh, the pharmacy is another great one to to build because it will treat multiple illnesses. A group of pharmacy patients were kicked out of a jumbo hospital for making slanderous comments about uh, Mr. McNally and are now looking for further treatment. Uh, we'll be rewarded if we treat this group of patients. Um, ramshackled. We don't know this illness. We're, go we're going to take it on. Um, so let's build the pharmacy. There was a pharmacy nurse available. Uh, recently. I wonder if they're still available. There we go. Get that in there. Okay. Now we're going to need this and uh, uh, this. Um, that. Excellent. Food and drink. Very important. Uh, uh, we've decided plants are, ha are a thing now. They're happening. Um, and we're going to need a chair. A chair. Uh, this one. Thank you. And we'll let them be cool over there. There we go. Um, let's hire an. Uh, uh, we don't have them anymore. Induces nausea. No. We're going to have to get this ridiculous nurse here. They they definitely need replacing our pharmacy nurse. My goodness. Rubbish. Um, okay. I mean, they've got lots of qualifications, but they're crazy qualifications. Absolutely crazy qualifications. Uh, there we are. Anyway, so... Ooh, killed them. Uh, so... Wow. 
Okay, rams, ramshackled. Okay. <laughs> ramshackled. Sufferers are struck or shackled as a fornia, uh, form of themselves <laughs> and may exhibit uncharacteristically mischievous or hornful behaviour. Needs to be treated with an especially disgusting type of medicine known as an anti goat. Uh, <laughs> luckily, sufferers can eat just about anything. <laughs> Love it. They're amazing. I love them. <laughs> Is it difficult? We seem to be good. We seem to be good. I can't believe it. They're amazing. Let's uh, let's get them some bennies. Yeah, go sit down. Amazing. Love it. Right. Um, anyway, <laughs> back to items then. Let's uh, see what else we've got going on here. Um, so, yeah, our, car our carrots there. Uh, rainwater fell from the sky, fills up over time. So we've got one here. Um, so let's... Now, fills up over time. So what I'll do, I'm going to put a couple here. Um, we'll do that. We'll put, we'll put a couple in. Where's the others? Ah. Oh, he's eating a carrot. Or oh, she is. Excellent. Let's put in a couple of... <laughs> oh, look. It is actually regenerating. That's amazing. Excellent. Okay, good. What's going on with you? 78%. We are going to send you for treatment. Uh oh Foot in mouth. An infection of the judgment gland caused by double yolks and too many group chats. <laughs> Sufferers will keep saying the wrong thing and must be cured before they really blow it and swallow themselves whole. Amazing. And that's the injection room, you see. It's great. And it deals with multiple illnesses um, at a time, which is, which is just great. Uh, so back to items. We, wanna, we want to have a look at all these amazing off-the-grid items. Uh, so what have we got here? Because attractiveness is a thing right now. And I like the look of this. A wall plant just hanging out. 250 to balloons and we can unlock it for 50 kudosh. Increases hospital attractiveness. Our kudosh is fine, by the way. Um, in fact, uh, am I doing... Oh, look. I am doing a super bug with somebody. So what I will do, I'll do this timed research. Um, but if you would like uh, me to help out in a super bug... Uh, do feel free to pop into my Discord. Um, we've got a whole bunch of us in there doing uh, super bugging and we help each other out. Um, but I've worked through the last batch of people that came into the Discord and uh, we seem to be slowing down. So with this DLC, I'm hoping to find uh, more peeps that need help. Uh, what have we got here? 59. Um, okay, let's, let's send them home. Um, let's... Really oh, let's have a look for janitors, side. actually. Oh, unhygienic. No. Missy, grumpy. I mean, sure. Oh, no, but staff happiness. So you know what? You're fired. Staff happiness is a real issue here. Is an issue here, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, we need... So these, these binnies, uh, I would say, uh, are a new addition. Um, Janitor, please right, place, so, but I didn't see them on the, the off the grid list, they, they must be there, they're not actually there, that's interesting because a recycling bin is new, uh, I'm sure that's an off the grid item, why isn't it in the off the grid uh, item thingies, what on earth, what's with you, uh, send for treatment, excellent, what's this, I think it's the same person isn't it, uh, except, can we have somebody... Do we have a janitor on that? I'm sure that I do. Ooh. Excellent. So then. Yeah, we do. We do. Um, just leave them on everything for the minute. They'll be fine. Excellent. Oh, So, is that uh, a chromotherapy patient? I think. But they look a bit more shiny than normal. No, I think they are still that though. What is that hippie looking? <laughs> hippie looking patients. Oh, animal magnetism. <laughs> Amazing. I'm loving the new outfits that they've they've got for patients. These new outfits. Beads. I like that they're wearing beads. 
Okay, excellent. Um, let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I wanted to unlock this plant. Let's see how much. How much? Because this looking go behind Benny's. <gasps> oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, it's so nice. Oh my god, I'm totally one over. That is amazing. I'm in love. Right, okay. <laughs> Can we put them here? Oh! Not near the sink. Okay, let's just get rid of that. Let's go. Let's get rid of that one. Um, let's have a look at them. Oh! Look, they're so pretty! What is this? A dream catcher. Well, I can see it's a dream catcher, but it does increase hospital attractiveness. Excellent. A safe pair of hands. 300 uh, doubloons, 150 kudosh. Do they go? Oh. Let's uh let's see what kind of attractiveness we're we getting out of this. Brought to you by Aunt Change Plus. <gasps> Look at it. Cleaner, more generous aunt. Love it. Okay. What's this here? Cryptohedron. So many corners. 800 kudosh to unlock. Wow, it's quite expensive, isn't it? 5,000 doubloons. So um, it increases prestige as well. Let's have a look at this. It moves. I feel like this is something I would want to put in my... Um, can't really afford to do those but i feel like these are something i'd want to put in my um close encounter hospitals i mean they're just so amazing look at that Isn't they amazing if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe thank you to all my patreons for their continued support